Hi boys and girls, my name is Miss Brittany and I'm a teacher at home. I'm at home just like you are and I thought we could do a fun activity. This week our study is based on clothing. So I thought we could sort short sleeve shirts and long sleeve shirts. We wear short sleeve shirts in the summertime and we wear long sleeve shirts in the winter time. I have a little chart here to talk about what else we might wear in the winter and in the summer. In the winter, it's very cold outside. It's usually snowing. We might wear jackets or pants or boots. And then in the summertime, it's very hot. And we might wear sandals or shorts or t-shirts. Now, I thought you could go check your closet to see if you have a long sleeve shirt and a short sleeve shirt to see if we could sort yours as well. Go ahead, go check it out. I bet you you have some. I'll wait right here. Nice job, you found some. Okay, so I have some here too as well. I have a shirt. I bet you you could guess what this one is. Yes, you're right. It's a short sleeve shirt. It has no sleeves. And I have another kind of shirt here. It's a little bit different. Yes, again, you're right. It is a long sleeve shirt because it has long sleeves. I would wear this one in the winter and I would wear this one in the summer when it's nice and hot. Now, I thought we could sort our shirts. If you think the long sleeve shirt should go here on this side, then put up a thumbs up. Nice job. If you think the short sleeve shirt should go on the other side, give me a thumbs up. Nice job. Now let's try the other ones. Let's see if you could do it by yourself. I have this one. It's a long sleeve. Where do you think it goes? Good job. And then I have this one. Oh yes, you got it. And then this one, yup. And then this one, and this one, and lastly, this one. That's a lot of shirts. Let's count to see which one was the greatest and the least amount. I had one, two, three, four, five short sleeve shirts. Did you guess five? Great job. Let's see how many long sleeve shirts. Ready? One, two, three. Nice job, boys and girls. Keep on learning.